you talk to a producer, ask him a question like, uh, hey, do you, do you uh, retain your heifers? And, you know, for your, to replace your cows. And, and then uh, those that do, you ask them the question, do you ever, when you're calving out heifers, do, uh, do you ever see one with a blind quarter? And they, you know, generally most guys will say, yeah, I see a few every now and then. But actually 75% of all heifers, and this is according to Dr. Nickerson at, at uh, University of Georgia, 75% yep. of all heifers have mastitis before they calve. He attributes 50% of that mastitis to the horn fly. So we know that heifers are gonna be more valuable than they've been in, in quite a few years. And it's really imperative that producers do everything they can to protect that investment and by, by having a good fly control program and feeding out to Sid and preventing those, those cases of mastitis where they can and just overall improving the health of the herd and those heifers. From our standpoint, you know, from, from the standpoint of, of fly control, we've got several things that we can do, but, but the number one thing would be using our, our feed through product, Altacid, to control horn flies. So the impact that they have on, on general health and, and uh, also condition and, you know, just uh, keeping those animals happy. By using Altacid in their, their mineral or tubs, then what, what we do is we don't treat the animal, we're treating the manure where those flies are reproducing and we're breaking that life cycle. The altacid goes into the cow and through their, their rumen and, and the digestive system into the manure, which is the only place where horn flies lay their egg is in fresh cow manure. And once those eggs are laid there, then it prevents them from hatching out. So it's, it's really a, a cost effective way to, to treat for horn flies. It doesn't require much labor other than putting out that product. You don't have to pin the cows. You're not stressing those heifers. You're not stressing your, your work crew. So it really makes a lot of sense to, to base a fly control program over feeding out to sit. It's really quite inexpensive, especially like if we're talking about a 750, 800 pound heifer, we're talking, you know, maybe two and a half cents per head per day. We're gonna increase weight gain. That means that heifer's gonna breed sooner. We're gonna, we're gonna get her out there producing a calf sooner. And also we're gonna prevent mastitis. Especially when we start looking at how often and, and how horn flies can uh, spread mastitis in replacement heifers, you know, that's really gonna be re be very important in these heifers that we want their their udders and their milk production to be at their top level and you know leaving horn flies uncontrolled we know that as temperatures heat up those horn flies move from the back of cattle to those bellies and you know the, the most tender skin on that animal is her udder producers you know they they know that their animals are going to be worth more this year and next year more than likely they're going to be looking for programs and products to use to make those animals more healthy, make them more productive. Nothing could do a better job for them than Altacid in their, in their feeding program.